Instagram and on our YouTube asking um, you guys to ask us questions for this video uh, and you guys did and so we're gonna be answering those today it's very exciting for those of you who are new here I'm number one sheep obviously my name is Titus and and I am the second sheep and my name is Max and I'm the third sheep and my name is Parker and we're gonna be answering your questions so let's just dive right in our first most asked question And uh, yeah, here we are. Which was that first video that we posted? Yeah. Yeah, of us. That was the one that we made yep. that night. So yeah. And it was really just for fun. We just really, no yeah. particular reason. We didn't think it was going to go anywhere. We just thought it would be fun, yeah. frankly. And, and, so. and the name is like, because um, people always say, like, counting sheep before going to bed is like, makes you tired. So we thought that it would be cool, like, to have the idea of yeah. us being cheap. A couple people ask who came up with the idea and how did the idea for three sheep ASMR start? Well, we wanted to use three in the name. We thought about three Z's, uh, three sleep ASMR, um, but we wanted something that instantly made you think we, of sleep. We even thought of making it one, two, three sleep in the actual name. Yeah. But uh, ultimately we went with three sheep ASMR, which I think was yeah. my idea. Um, but yeah. Which I think was the best video. I think I think I said one, two, three sheep ASMR and then yeah. we decided on three sheep ASMR. So yeah, that's how that started. And here we are. The next comment is is it just you three or do you have more siblings? And yes we do. We have eight siblings, uh, not including us, so there's nine kids total. Um, so we each have eight siblings. So but there's only six in the house, including us. Yeah. Six kids still living at home. So. Yeah. Yeah, big family. And yes, somebody else asked if we would have them on the channel eventually. Yes, we will have some of them on the channel, those that want to do it. Um, and I think our next video, we're going to have some guests. Yeah. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Yeah. The next one is, what are you guys' goals for the channel? Favorite trigger, favorite, favorite ASM artist. What is something you want to accomplish in the future? Career, travel, dreams, thanks. Um, there's a lot of questions there. Um, goals for this channel. I mean, definitely grow it. Um, and uh, I definitely want to try some different uh, styles of ASMR. Like, eventually I want to try and do a soft-spoken ASMR. And uh, you guys had mentioned only whispering, which Titus did, but I think us yeah well we will both do one together as well and maybe even all three at some point and of course our number one priority is to bring you the best sounds and the best sleep yes and um fa favorite trigger uh, scrub daddy mine is probably towel sounds or something yeah i think probably the leather jacket that he used in his video or glove sounds Glove sounds are awesome, especially with the visual trigger yeah. of having it up in front of the camera. Yeah. And then, uh, favorite is 
smartest. I mean, probably Raffi Taffy. Yeah, Raffi Taffy. <laughs> I think all far says. And uh, he was like the first guy ASMR artist I saw. And uh, his setting and breaking the pattern videos, uh, those are just the best. I, they yeah. give me chills like crazy. I also really like uh, ASMR Zeitgeist. Yeah. Oh. He's really good. Um, what yeah. ASMR, ASMR Eliza? is one that I like. Yeah. Patrick's ASMR is a new one that I really like. Um, there's also yeah. a barber guy. Oh, yeah. That, I don't he know how to say nice. his name. He's really, he's really good. Somewhere on the screen. Um, what about then, you, Titus? Favorite ASMR artist? Uh, probably Raffi Raffi or Zeitgeist. Um, what is something you want to accomplish in the future? I want to be a physical fitness instructor, try and train people and help them to grow stronger, especially skinnier people who have trouble putting on muscle. So, uh, yeah. I don't really know what I want to be. There's so many things that I... An artist. <laughs> um, but I, there's so many things that I don't, I just don't know about and so I, um, yeah. Mine would be to be a successful musician, uh, at least enough to support myself uh, by my music, and we'll probably talk more about that because a couple of people asked some questions about that. So, dreams and travel. Uh, dreams is pretty much the same as the other one, I feel like. But travel, um, I would love to go to New Zealand and see where they uh, filmed Lord of the Rings. That would be really awesome. How about you, Titus?
awesome film. It has everything that I love about movies. It is a gritty movie. Um, so, yeah, just be warned if you want to watch it. It's, it's definitely an adult movie. I haven't seen it. <laughs> <laughs> a couple people asked us who our favorite artist was in our favorite album. And, uh, do you want to start, Titus? Yeah, um, my favorite album is Scale Blue I See. so far and I'm working on another one and uh, yeah I release it under the name UFO race there'll be links in the description and probably some stuff on the screen uh, if you want to listen to it that'd be awesome it's my dream to uh, successfully grow a fan base of my music and uh, have people actually listen to it so um, yeah and somebody also asked what producers or writers inspire me um, there's a lot of producers on YouTube that amazing and um, have taught me everything that I know um, but if you're looking to get into producing and just really learning how to think about music as far as producing uh, Beat Academy uh, is a great YouTube that's really inspiring to watch um, so yeah those are the people and then there's tons of artists that inspire me I have a playlist on my um, UFO race page if you're interested in more of the music that I listen to and what inspires me so yeah go listen if you want to if you don't it's cool just enjoy ASMR and relax the next comment is what are Titus's favorite fall activities um I like um, not just going out um with my siblings and going outside and playing um or just like we have a um like a bat like about the character slash shows he has Funkos and posters for. Um, I have a poster of Stranger Things back on my wall of season two. Um, I really like that show. It's really awesome. And I also have a uh, pop figure of um, Ryuk back there that some people have mentioned in the videos. And uh, yeah, I really like Death Note. Um, I think he's a really cool character. And uh, I also have uh, a lot of Avatar stuff in my room because that's probably one of my favorite TV shows ever. Um, and uh, yeah, I really like, uh, a lot of people were asking what my favorite character is and I really like Sokka, I really like Asula and uh, Zuko. All of those three are awesome. Um, uh, and then, yeah, I'll probably do a show and tell where I show all my pop figures. 
pictures and talk about them. So, yeah. And the next comment is, are you homeschooled? Yes. Um, I think we, we've never, like, we've never not been homeschooled. I love homeschooling. It's so fun. And, uh, yeah. I don't know how this person, what made this person think that we were homeschooled. Yeah. We are. I don't know how you guessed it, but yeah, good guess. Good guess. Um, and it's been a huge blessing. Yeah. Being homeschooled has been a blessing. So, uh, yeah. What is your favorite restaurant? What is your favorite drink besides water? Um, my favorite restaurant, uh, probably Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A. <laughs> um, the most homeschooled answer. <laughs> um, and my favorite drink besides water, uh, Thai Dr. Rivers is really good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which I know that's his. I know that's his. We're, we're pretty similar. Well, in all honesty, me, my brothers and I are is Chick Fil A Chick-fil-A your favorite restaurant too? Um, probably. <laughs> I mean, there's also the Eagle. There's a bar in Cincinnati called the Eagle, and it's really good. What did you say? Your favorite drink besides water? Um, my favorite drink is water. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite drink is probably from McDonald's. It's their strawberry and banana smoothie, and it's just really good. I love it. The next one is what was your favorite? Uh, kids show growing up. Um, Phineas and Ferb, easy. Um, my favorite was probably Blue's Clues. I really like Veggie Tales. <laughs> yeah, that's mine. It's Veggie Tales. We have a bit of a generational thing, I think. Uh, Phineas and Ferb probably would have been my favorite uh, if I grew up watching it, but I grew up watching Veggie Tales, which is sick. I'm not complaining. But... The next comment is what is each of your favorite ice cream flavor. Mine is probably definitely cookies and cream. Or not cookies and cream. Um, I love cookies and cream, but my favorite is mint chocolate chip without the chips in it. Does that make sense? It's just mint ice cream. It's just mint ice cream. <laughs> Mine is definitely cookies and cream. Mine is either strawberry or mint chocolate chip. It's hard to decide. I think we all really like mint chocolate chip a lot. Does Max play any video games? I always see nerdy things in the background. Um, I I play a couple of video games. I play I played Red Dead Redemption. That's probably my favorite game. It is pretty gritty. Um, to those of you who are looking for a new game, just be warned. I also really like Skyrim a lot, and I like obviously Minecraft is one of the greatest. Um, uh, yeah, I play, I've been playing Boulder Skate with, Boulder Skate 3, that just came out with, uh, my brothers, uh, Parker, and the one that you haven't met yet. Uh, so yeah, those are a lot of the games that I play. I also love Half-Life 1, 2, Part 1 and Part 2, um, and, uh, Half-Life Alex and all of those games, Portal, all the ones in that world, are really awesome, so yeah. The next one is, what are your guys' favorite hobbies? Um, Thais, you went first. Uh, yeah, uh, my favorite is probably, um... ASMR. I like drawing, um, like pictures, and I also, um, I like painting. I'm not very good at it, but, um, I like painting, so. Um, my favorite hobbies, I really like playing piano. I piano a lot. I also make music. Um, I just don't master it and I don't put it out anywhere. I just do it for fun on my computer. And uh, I really like to skateboard as well. I don't do it as much as I used to. But uh, for a while I did magic tricks as well. But I don't do them as much anymore either. Uh, you could do it sometime. He might do a magic ASMR video. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. That's a good idea. That would be fun. Um, but the main one is piano. Yeah, same, same here. Um, piano, guitar. Um, I spend a lot of time making music and writing music, so I guess that would be my number one hobby. Um, but I do a lot of creative stuff. I do a lot of writing, um, world building for our Dungeons Dragons campaign. Yeah. So, Dungeons Dragons. Yeah, so, yeah. The next comment is, for whoever is playing D&D, what kind of characters do you play? I play as on a human artificer named Vincent and he, he's got a gun on his side and he's kind of partly an inventor as well. We kind
kind of made up our own kind of thing. Uh, but uh, my sister plays with us, who you haven't seen. Um, but she plays with us, and she's part of my backstory, and she's one of the characters that's like always with me, and it's kind of a cool dynamic. I play as the dungeon master, um, so I play a lot of characters. But if I was to play um, as a character, I would probably play as Argus Argyle, who is basically just a more comedic version of Gandalf, um, or uh, a new character that I've been playing in Baldur's Gate 3, uh, Rubis or Cumbernob, who is just a gnome bard, but, um, yeah. We all play together, um, yeah. in Dungeons Dragons. Um, all six of the kids at home, yeah, play Dungeons Dragons. Not our mom and dad. <laughs> One day, we'll get them. Yeah, we'll get them. If you could be any kitchen utensils, which one would you be? <laughs> I would probably be a knife because I'd be cutting bread all day. I'm just gonna, but I don't have to go in someone's mouth and I don't know, I like cutting things. <laughs> Actually, he's a really good point. They don't have to go in somebody's mouth. I didn't even think about that. Um, I don't, I legitimately have no idea. Chopsticks, maybe. I'd be a spork. It, slap a saddle on it and ride it. Which would it be? Which would you pick? Uh, probably a turtle. That'd be pretty fun, but it would be pretty slow. Probably a bearded dragon because basically it'd just be a dragon. Yeah, at that point, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, maybe a hawk or a dolphin or something like that. You probably could already ride dolphins. Or like a bald eagle, so then yeah, you could fly. Eagle. If you could swim in a pool of anything, what would it be? I've thought about this a lot when I was a kid, and it was used to always be chocolate milk, and I stand by that. that that's the same as me. When I was a kid, I actually, every time I would woke up, wake up, I would literally just have chocolate milk. <laughs> oh man, probably, probably died Dr. Pepper if I'm being honest. That was pretty cool too. Oh man, this stuff is good. Or just even carbonated water, just to see what it feels yeah. like. Oh, well, I would be, um, strawberry banana smoothie from, uh, McDonald's. It'd be cold. <laughs> It'd be cold, yeah. The next question is, which is your favorite NFL teams? Um, I probably watch football the most, I don't Um, I'm a Browns fan. I'm not necessarily a fan of their quarterback right now. Um, but, uh, yeah, I like the Browns. I love Nick Chubb. Rip. Um, but now they have Cream on, and we'll see what happens with them. I also love watching Patrick Mahomes. Love him or hate him. He's a good quarterback, and I enjoy watching him. Um, I love the Dolphins. I think that they're a great team and have a lot of great players. I'm more of a player person than a team person, other than the Browns. I'll always root for the Browns, but, um, yeah. Yeah, mine is probably the same. Probably the Browns. Um, but I love... Uh, oh, I forget some of their names. I'm not really super into football, but I love um, Patrick Mahomes and Lamar Jackson. Uh, it's really fun to watch as well. I really like those two players. They're really cool to watch what they do. I'm not super into football, but I would probably say Dolphins and Browns. When it comes to college, obviously it's the Buckeyes. Yeah. yeah. Also, somebody asked where we're based. I guess we might as well say that. It, it's yeah. Ohio. Yeah, it's Ohio. Tell by our football teams. We are based in Ohio. The next comment is, what is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. <laughs> Do you watch ASMR in your free time? Uh, yeah, I sometimes. I Usually just when I'm like going to bed, obviously, yeah. but um, or when I'm just trying to relax. I put it on in the background a lot when I'm writing or world building for Dungeons and Dragons. It's usually like non speaking, just triggers. Um, so it helps me, yeah, so it helps me focus um, a little bit better. I would listen to music, but I get too distracted by the music. So. Oh. No, start going. Yeah. <laughs> I'll start doing that exact thing. Yeah. Next is uh, favorite chip flavor, the top three. Um, Probably sun chips, maybe. Whatever sun chips are, whatever that flavor is. Sun chips, Pringles. Cheese, I guess, would be 
Doritos. Just the classic nacho. I like yeah. cheese. I just like yeah. cheese. I also really like barbecue. Like any... Oh, that I feel like that's the most, like, across different types of chips. Barbecue is usually the one that stays the most consistent yeah. for me. Doritos. Lay's. Sun chips. Cheese. <laughs> okay, good. Good, good, good. Um, good. My next comment is... Dum -ba -da -dum. Do you have any pets? No. Do Eventually, we want to get a turtle. And tap on it. And tap on it for his more. Yeah, we Because we, about we love turtles. Yeah. Anyways, all of us do. It'd be really cool. But that'd be really cool. Also a snake, like a turtle and a snake that we could have on yeah. the channel. That'd be really cool. Yeah. I also And always, a bearded dragon. Yeah, those are cool too. Yeah. I also always have wanted to have a um, sugar glider.